What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Landon Share, and today we have a super special video because you guys are going to get to meet all of the animals here at ZWF. You guys might have seen them before if you guys have been on the channel before and if you guys are new, welcome to the channel. If you guys have been here before, welcome back. We are going to enter the first enclosure now. Some of these animals you guys might see me cuddle with. Some of them you might see me feed, but we are just gonna have to see what animals we encounter today. The first First one here. We're taking you up here to see the first animals of the day. And what is this butt in my face over here? Hello, is anyone home? Oh my goodness. Is this the sloth enclosure? Is this where all the sloths are sleeping? Oh, we got a sleepy sloth poking his head out. Hello, Mr. Sloth. Hi, Mr. Sloth. Mr. Sloth is coming out of the barrel. Hello. Hello, this is actually a Mrs. Sloth, not a Mr. Sloth. We've got four sloths in here. If she would move her butt out of the way, you guys can see all of the different claws and furry butts stuffed into this barrel. We've got a baby in here. Here she is. Oh my goodness, she's clawing me. We're getting clawed by the baby sloth. Oh my goodness, look at those beautiful eyes. Hello, little sloth girl. She is just doing great. You guys would have seen some videos of her on the channel when she was tinier, but she's still pretty small. She's growing real good. Look at them. All the sloths are coming out now, all four of them. Let's head to the next enclosure. Who do we have here? Who do we have here? Are we just rolling around having fun in the shade? We've got Masha and Vladim, the Amur leopards. Look at Vladim up here. Look how beautiful this big boy is. You guys have seen them before. These are the Russian leopards, and they are just so beautiful. We'll see if Masha wants to go. Oh, Masha! Oh, sweet girl, hi. Oh, are we just full of love today, rubbing all over? And here is a different cat. Oh, big jump. Look at that spring and jump. These are the servals, similar to the leopards, but these guys are not from Russia, they're from Africa. And they've got that big spring and jump, those long legs. Hi, sweet girl. Hi, missy girl. Oh, we don't want to be touched today. Oh, oh goodness. We are in the big aviary now, and you can see we are with our massive storks. These are African storks and they're one of the largest wading birds in the world. They've got a huge wingspan with those big dark wings and then you can see the fluffy feathers that pile up on their neck but stop just as it gets right here and it turns into this big bald head and the reason why their head has no fluffy feathers is because they eat everything including carrion. Carrion is non-living animals. They go and pick at it and all that rotten nasty stuff would just get caught in those fluffy feathers if they had feathers there. So that's why the bald head actually helps them out. They're kind of uh, freaky looking, but I guess you could think they're beautiful. This enclosure actually used to be for the flamingos and the flamingos are waiting for us. Look who's been patiently waiting. These guys are just beautiful. Over the years, we have lost a few flamingos. Hi, beautiful flamingos. We're kind of freaking them out a little bit. They are just getting used to this new habitat over here. They were switched, the storks were in here, but we decided these guys could use a more intimate enclosure, a smaller space for them. They have a little pond here, which is easy to clean all the time. We could put their food in it. They'll love it. It's surrounded by these big bushes. And then the storks get to have that big flying aviary because these guys don't don't use all of that aerial space as much as the storks do. Now getting into our primate zone, this is where all of the monkeys are. And our first monkeys, we have to show you our Phil and Steve, the beautiful, the amazing, the long-haired and fabulous colobus monkeys. They are just gorgeous. They're one of the most beautiful animals we have here, especially the most beautiful monkeys because of that special coat. And over here, we have our capuchin monkeys. Now these are wedge cap capuchins. Oh my goodness, what are you doing with this little hand? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, what is that funky hand? I don't have as much of a relationship with these guys as I do with these girls over here. In here we have Dee Dee and Angie, and actually guys, today you will see for the first time our new baby monkey. She's in here. 
if she'll come up close to us. Oh my goodness, look at the little baby. She is just so cute. Guys, here are our Brazilian tufted capuchin monkeys. I'm gonna grab another monkey biscuit. These girls are just hanging out today. I'm trying to hold a monkey biscuit to see if I can give it to them, but it looks like they've already got their own. There are beautiful girls, Dee Dee and Angie, and now we have a new baby. So you guys need to comment down below a name for the baby. Here we have Kasem. Hello, big boy. Hello, big boy, come here. Look how beautiful he is, and his girlfriend, well, soon to be girlfriend, is over here hooting and hollering. Cassie, come here, Cassie. Hi, mama. Oh my goodness, Tessie is the big giving girl that you saw us drive across the state to go pick up. She's giving me her belly now for some scratches. She's a beautiful white handed giving girl. Oh my goodness, you just have a lot to say. I don't know if you guys have ever seen this guy before, but he might have a little song for us. <laughs> Are you laughing at me? Cause I had a funny song. Let's say it again. <laughs> oh my goodness. That is a really good song. This is our kookaburra. He is a beautiful bird, a crazy hunter from Australia. And right back here behind him, if we walk up these crazy little steps, oh my goodness, what is going on up here? This is a stinky mess, oh my goodness, it smells so bad if you guys put your nose into here. These are our Tamanduas, our little Tamandua kids. Usually we come and greet them with a special snack of some honey. They'll stick their big long tongue down the tube and lap up some honey for us. But these are crazy little ant eaters. They're lesser ant eaters. I think one's coming out. Come here. What are you doing back there? Oh my goodness. Look at that cute little guy. You are just adorable. And in this enclosure, I kind of have to keep my eyes on the water here. My eyes on the prize. We've got Lazy, our massive alligator we've done a lot of videos in lazy's pond and with lazy if you guys want to see lazy crunch a thanksgiving turkey comment down below what are you crying about over here you crazy otter kids on the other side of lazy we have some crocodiles they're beautiful and gorgeous but you can't really do too much with them but feed them and they've already been fed today but these little guys haven't been fed and you can see they're crying for some food oh my goodness these little Asian small clawed river otters get fed three times a day and somehow yet they're still hungry. I think somebody is stalking me behind me. Oh my goodness. Look at this big kitty boy. Brashkar, are you stalking me or are you just laying down hanging out? This is our big golden tabby tiger. Oh, look at the big yawn, look at the big teeth. He's just a gorgeous guy. He has this gorgeous strawberry blonde color, which is where he gets the name, the golden tabby tiger. There are four different color variations of the tiger. There's this big guy, the golden tabby tiger, and then we have these beautiful girls in this enclosure. They are not, unfortunately, with, oh, pee time. Oh, she's gonna pee. False alarm on that one. These girls are not able to be with Boshkar yet because he's just too big. You can see the size difference. But in here, we've got a royal white tiger, which is the white with those big black stripes. Then we have this snow tiger, Sukino, which is the white tiger with the blonde stripes. And then we have another golden tabby tiger, and that is Sarah. Over here we have our lemurs. Oh my goodness, hi little hands. Hi little hands. These guys are so crazy and beautiful. They have the most gorgeous eyes. Would you like a biscuit? 
Hey, don't try to grab me all crazy. I'm not taking your biscuits. These are tri-colored lemurs. They're a mixture of a black and white rough and a red rough lemur. We also have some black and whites over here. What are you doing? Are you just sniffing some monkey biscuits? They look pretty similar to the tri-colored lemurs, but they don't have that lighter brown in them. Just beautiful animals, but my favorite primate on the property has to be this little guy. Oh my goodness, hello people back at home. This is Roro, the most beautiful capuchin boy. He is a Brazilian tufted capuchin, just like the little baby and the girls that you guys saw. Hello, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, why are you being crazy? Now, obviously, he is my favorite monkey, but my favorite primate, my favorite ape, has to be a very special guy, which you guys, I think, are gonna get to see in the end because he is gonna be the grand finale. But Romeo is probably one of the cutest little monkeys that we have. Look at this little guy. How could you not think that he is just the most adorable thing in the world? Look at the little face. He said, I got you. I got you. We are going to put this guy back and then you guys are gonna see a crazy horned animal. You know what they say, when you mess with the goat, you get the horns. Oh my goodness, are you smelling me? Are you a big beautiful boy? Look at these big old horns here. This is Tofu the goat. Hello little goat. Oh my goodness. Hi, hi people back at home. My name is Tofu and I'm a big beautiful goat. This is Tofu. He's just full of love. He's really just a big dog. I think I might take him home and bring him next to Maverick. Uh, they might just be the best of friends. Oh, big stink of face and little big boy love to scratch. Oh my goodness. You have some of the most beautiful teeth I ever did see, Tofu. He's got his girlfriend over here. These are just some of our petting zoo animals, but behind him, unfortunately, this set of keys does not have the uh, key for this lock, so we can't go in with Mr. Jara, but he's a gorgeous kangaroo boy. These are the Jaguar kids. We've got Onyx and we've got Amber. Hi, sweet boy, do you want some scratchies? Do you want scratchies? Oh, he stopped from pacing back and forth and stopped for some scratchies. Now guys, if you are ever close to a big cat, please do not do this. Hey, big scratchy boy. Hey, big scratchy boy. I have built a relationship with both of these guys. Here comes Amber. They are beautiful cats, the two different color variations of the Jaguar. Hi, sweet girl. What a beautiful pattern. One of the most amazing and the strongest animals on the planet. Their jaws are stronger than any big cat, pound for pound. They can just crush any of their prey items. Oh my goodness, but right now they're not looking very dangerous and crazy. They're looking pretty sweet getting their boops and their scratches through the fence. Man, here he is, the biggest boy. Hello, hello big boy. Hello big boy, everybody's leaning in for scratches. Oh man, look at that big yawn. This is Max. Sometimes he can be sweet and cuddly. You guys have definitely seen him on the channel here other times where he's not so sweet he has a little bit of a temper when he's around food i was wondering if he was going to pee over here hey big boy come here give us a twist oh man oh scratchy scratching in the mane this is max our big male lion our only male lion on the property big yawns oh man why are you so sleepy he's such a sleepy boy max is coming to say hi to zeus oh man so this is the new enclosure guys if you haven't seen the shift video where we moved this lion pride to this big enclosure where they have a massive waterfall i do want to do something cool some fun ideas maybe a bubble bath for the big cats again if you guys want to see that you're going to have to subscribe to the channel but zeus is coming out over there he's our big liger boy then we've got our girl over here, the white lion girl, glowing in all her blonde glory. This is our beautiful pride, and hopefully soon, Dana will be mixed back with them. Dana is in this enclosure by herself. We had to shift the lions to the other side of the property. The rest of her pride, look at her. 
She is just recovering. She actually had distemper, guys, and it's really sad, but she's on the road to recovery. If you guys wanna watch some of the other videos on the channel about shifting the pride and how we have to treat her, you guys need to check that out. Look who's coming up to us now. We have the beautiful Petra girl, the clouded leopard, hi. Hello, sweetheart. She is just walking all over her enclosure. Look at the aerial space that she has to climb. In the wild, they would be climbing all over big branches up in the treetops. They are a smaller species of cat, a lot smaller than the different species you guys have seen today, especially those big lion kids that we were just at. And right next to them, we have our singing dogs and our wolf puppies. Our wolf puppies are not so little anymore. They are big arctic wolf kids and our singing dogs are little but they are mighty and they are tough they are new guinea singing dogs and like i said arctic wolves just a beautiful coat that all of them are developing oh my goodness usually throughout the day they're singing their songs the singing dogs howl and the wolves howl together and all over the zoo you can hear it it's a beautiful sound and guys if you did not know you can come here and see all of these animals but there's one special animal we haven't brought out yet and that is here he is what are you got what have you got there is that a crazy popsicle limbani's just slurping on a little hot day treat where are you going up in the tree Oh man, oh man, up top. Look at the big guy swing. He's getting to be a big growing chimpanzee boy. This is Limbani, the most special guy here. And if you guys have seen this channel, you've definitely seen Limbani before. He's our seven year old chimpanzee boy and he is really my best friend. Can you come on down? Let's go down right here. Hold on, we got a foot in the leash. Guys, this leash is just for Limbani's protection. Come on down, let's go, let's go, sit. Oh yeah, right there. This leash is just for Limbani's protection. It keeps him safe and it keeps the animals around him safe. It keeps him close by us. Obviously, you wouldn't want him getting too close to those big lion kids. But guys, that is all for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Limbani wants to go back up in the tree. Go on up. Oh man. Swinging monkey. He's not a monkey. I call him funky monkey, stinky monkey, chunky monkey, but he is an ape. He is a great ape. And again, he is a chimpanzee and he's so special to us here. So if you stuck around watching this whole video, there are a couple little animals that you actually didn't get to see and you're gonna have to see those when you visit here, but we covered the majority of it. If you guys like this video, please give it a like, subscribe to the channel, crashing down. I will see you guys in the next adventure. Peace.